Thanks for being with us tonight. First tonight, it's National Nurses Week, and Central Texas needs more health care workers. Local hospital leaders say there are quite a few ways to get your start in the industry. Connor Board shares the story of a young woman who took a less traditional route to start on her path to becoming a nurse. Right behind us is where I went to school. Hutto High School, where Elizabeth Godetto Partridge graduated from just a year ago. Sometimes it still amazes me that I could work right across and then, you know, still see my my past. <laughs> her past, which helped her get to her present situation across the street. I took all my CMA classes there to get all my certifications. Working as a certified medical assistant at the Hutto Baylor Scott and White Clinic at just 19 years old. So I did a program in high school, a CMA program, where you have the opportunity to earn three certifications so you can earn your phlebotomy, your EKG technician, and your CMA, which I obtained all of them including my BSL. Taking this route helped save Elizabeth money and time. Going to school for two plus years just become a CMA when I when I did it in like eight months is a huge opportunity and a, you know, a huge time expense on me. With her high school degree mm -hmm. and certification. Just a quarter underneath 5'2", so 167. She has now been working at this clinic for about six months. I help room patients, I help you know get vital signs, I help clean rooms, I organize. Baylor Scott and White leaders like Mark Young Sherry say now. certified medical assistants are one of the many positions they are hiring for. A certified medical assistant, medical assistant is an outstanding opportunity for any individual that wants to get into the healthcare space or the healthcare careers. Once you are hired on, they put a focus on finding ways to help you grow while working in the hospital system. We provide an opportunity at the entry level for individuals to to learn as they earn, to grow within our organization. That is exactly what Elizabeth is doing right now. So I am going back to school for nursing, so they will help me with my tuition reimbursement and um, I can, you know, flexible schedule. I can do it night, days, whatever I need to, even on the weekends. Now with her past right across the street and her present tasks in front of her. Your oxygen's 92 and your pulse is 68. That's good. Elizabeth is now looking towards the future. I'm still young. I just graduated high school, so I'm 19 now, so there's always more for me to learn. Reporting in Hutto, I'm Connor Board.